Hey everyone, it's your favorite tech guru, Elliot here, back with another juicy bit of info that's going to change the game for all you Apple users out there. So you've got an iPad or iPhone that's giving you an electronic headache with that pesky lock to owner message or the iCloud activation lock. Been there, done that. It's a real bummer. You're probably thinking about drowning your sorrows in heaps of so-called miracle software or those tricky services claiming to free your device, right? Hold your horses there. I know it's tempting, but let's not venture down that rabbit hole. It might seem like a quick fix, but trust me, it's usually more hassle than it's worth, not to mention the risk of malware and the costs that come with it. But worry no more, my friends. I've got an alternative that's better, safer, and guess what? It's totally free. This method is not only quicker, but it's also absolutely guaranteed to work. So stay tuned, because in this video, I'm gonna walk you through the steps to unlock iPad activation lock without a computer. Trust me, you're gonna love this one. Let's dive in. Let's get one thing straight before we start. We're making this video to help you out in case you've forgotten how to get into your own device, not to help you get into someone else's. We're all about playing by the rules here. We're not supporting any kind of illegal actions or messing with someone else's stuff. Also, our video follows YouTube's rules and community standards. Now that we've got that covered, let's get going. All right, so let's get into the nitty gritty of the situation. You've got an iPad or iPhone that's locked and you're feeling a bit like you're caught in a techno maze, right? Well, let's explore some of your best options for sorting this out. Your first option is Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app. Imagine a super smart tech buddy in your corner working to get your device unlocked. That's what you're getting with this web app. It's pretty slick. Next up, we've got Locked Toner. This tool is for you if you're the rightful owner who has just unfortunately forgotten your access info. Easy, quick, and user-friendly, it's a solid choice. But wait, there's more. There's also Safe Unlocks, another top-notch choice for losing that lock-to-owner message without losing your cool. This tool walks you through the process so you're never left in the dark. Lastly, let's not forget iUnlock app. One of the best iCloud unlock services on the net, this app is a lifesaver if you're locked out of your device and need a way back in. Remember, these options are not about breaking any rules or getting into places we shouldn't. They're designed to help you, the legitimate owner, regain access to your device. This isn't a commercial, but rather a sharing of information for educational purposes. We're just here to help you navigate through the tech jungle. And stick around because we're not done yet. Coming up, we're gonna give you a step-by-step run-through of how to use Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant. Trust me, you won't wanna miss this. So, just a heads up, these unlocking services primarily operate in first world countries. If for some reason you're unable to use these services or you'd rather not, don't worry, we've got something else for you. We're giving away 250 unlocks every single week to our viewers. Yup, you heard that right. Want in? All you need to do is hit that like button on this video, make sure you're subscribed to the channel and drop a comment below. When you comment, be sure to let us know your device model, your IMEI number, and the country you're in. Once you've done these steps, you're automatically in the running to grab one of those unlocks for the week. Keep it simple and clear, folks. Let's get those devices unlocked. First things first, you're going to want to head to your web browser on either your phone or computer. Punch in unlockhere.com, which is a super handy web app powered by an AI assistant. This little genius, named Nifty, is going to help you unlock any mobile phone restriction you might be dealing with. Now that you're on the site, tell Nifty you're looking for an iCloud unlock. You'll find this under Activation Lock. From there, you'll need to let it know what kind of device you've got. For this purpose, we're choosing iPhone, but you could also select iPad or Apple Watch if that's what you have. Next up, you'll need to enter the IMEI, or serial number. If you're wondering where to find this, listen up iPhones all have IMEIs, so choose that if you're unlocking an iPhone. Some iPads and Apple Watches have IMEIs too, but only if they've got a SIM card slot or cellular capacity. If they don't, you'll want to use the serial number instead. To find this info, just press the sleep button on your lock device. Tap it again and then select the little I on the bottom right. You'll see all your device info right there. Don't forget to input this info in the next step. Following that, you'll need to enter some basic info to tie the order to your account. Make sure it's real info because you're going to get a confirmation code sent to your email. You'll need that to confirm your order. Once you've filled that out, check the box to agree to the terms. This is where you're also confirming that you're not trying to unlock a stolen device. Hit start process and complete the quick CAPTCHA to prove you're not a robot. Sit tight because you're about to get an email with a confirmation code. Remember to also check in your spam or junk folder because sometimes these things can wind up in there. 
Grab that confirmation code, click the button in the email, and you'll be directed to a page where you'll need to enter the code and once again prove you're not a robot. Once that's done, your unlock process has officially started and your device will soon be unlocked. As you can see here, we swipe up to see the iPhone lock to owner page. In this part, it really takes time and patience. We wait for the unlock process to activate the phone, and as you can see, we swipe left and wait for a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Don't worry, it'll be worth the wait. You will enjoy your phone once again once it's finally unlocked, so it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Patience is the key here. And there it is. In this part, let's skip all the setup. Don't worry, you can go back to set it all up later. Make sure to check the terms and conditions and skip the rest of the steps and just do it all later on. And there you have it. It says, welcome to iPhone. Now go to settings and create your own Apple ID. Tap, forget password, or don't have Apple ID to create a new one. And here you can just add your personal details to continue. And here's a shortcut to check your device info, making sure that this is legit. And yeah, your device is now fully unlocked and ready to use. All right, guys, let's dive into some more alternative ways to get rid of that pesky iCloud activation lock. We're all about doing things the right way here, so everything I'm about to share with you is totally above board and legal. Firstly, a simple yet often overlooked method is resetting your device via iCloud. Using another device or your computer, head over to iCloud.com and sign in with your Apple ID. Choose All Devices, select the device that's locked, then hit Erase. Once it's wiped clean, click Remove from Account, and voila, your iCloud activation lock should be no more. Next up, if you've got a device that's still covered by Apple's warranty, get in touch with Apple support. If you can provide proof that you're the legitimate owner of the device, they might be able to help you out. Our last method is to reach out to the previous owner of the device if it was secondhand. They can remove the activation lock by entering their Apple ID and password on your device. That's all for today. Thanks for hanging out with me today and see you in the next one.